So today we're going to go over the ratings for the Seagate drive of the 4 gigabyte, and at the bottom of the Amazon page, there'll be rankings for each single category. So I'm going to go over each and every single one of them to see if they're true or not. So these are the different categories. Obviously, we'll start at the top. This is a storage capacity of 4.6. We'll see how that goes. So as you can see here at four terabyte, there is 3.63 terabytes of usable storage and the rest are being used for system and also other tasks. So in terms of that, I think this is pretty good because I've seen my other drives be around the same. Like I said, this drive is two terabytes. So 1.8 is usable. This drive is one terabyte and only 9.29 gigabytes are usable. So the larger it gets, the less usable space you'll have because there's more space allocated to kind make the drive run so this is about what you should expect and for just using it I can click into it and go into it I click on a movie and it starts up really easily there's no buffering so for all intents and purposes this is a great drive for everyday use so I give the storage a 4.6 like it said next easy to use a 4.5 let's see when I first got this drive, I plugged it in. I didn't need to follow any steps and it just started working. And throughout the years, there is stuff where people do recommend that you uh, format it once in a while. And for other drives, you may need to eject them. For this drive, there's no even eject button. So you don't need to eject that. So it's just pull it out, put it back in. It's super simple. And for the formatting, I haven't formatted this drive in about like maybe five years and it's still working perfectly correct. No issues, it's still running super smooth and super fast. So I do think that is a great rating. So 4.5 is already pretty high, so we'll stay at there. So portability is next, 4.6. So for portability, let's see how much this weighs. This is with the cable. There's the tips are not exactly on weight. It's kind of hard to measure an accurate rating right here maybe around give like an extra 10 so maybe 260 so 15 260 grams so all total not too bad compare this with my phone my phone is basically just as heavy as uh, the drive so basically it's like having another uh, phone on your pocket or your bag so pretty portable and in terms of the package i have dropped this quite a few many times you can see there's some fingerprints there's some dents right here there's one dent there's also another dent there's multiple dents. This is from me dropping it and kind of hitting it on the, you know, on the side of the table, hitting on on, you know, other surfaces. So you can see that I've had quite a lot of usage on this drive. There are some scratches on here, but overall, it has not failed me. It has not lost any of my data. So I'm pretty pleasantly surprised with how rugged this drive is. So even though 4.6 is a high score, I'm gonna have to bump this up to a 4.7. And lastly, we have value for the money at 4.5. And obviously for a drive like this, you can definitely get a more storage, lighter package. You can get something that's even better than this for much less money, but it's usually from like Chinese manufacturers that are, you know, not really known for making the drives. Seagate and the other manufacturers like WD, they're known for making drives. So you expect quality and kind of longevity with them, which is what I've had with this drive. I haven't needed to replace this. I hadn't lost any data. And even the cables, you can see right here, this cable is built to be, you know, used in all different angles without really hurting because of this tip right here i've unplugged replugged both of this sides for probably like hundreds of times and they still work this is the cable that it came with with the drive like more than five years ago now so it really depends on your definition of value for the money if you just want the largest amount of storage for the lowest cost this is not it but what this is is longevity and safe and peace of mind for the warranty and also the support from ck so with that i would definitely pay the amount that this is charging. So so to each their own, and I will give this the standard 4.5. So it's up to you guys if you wanna give this out, but I do recommend this.